Hey there. So with the season of lawn care finally upon us and with kids really wanting to help out, I thought this might be the perfect opportunity to discuss the John Deere lawn and garden set, which is aged for a two plus. I think that's really good too. And it really works out for those age ranges because there's not a lot here that can be dangerous. There's nothing that you can really break off. And it allows your child to go outside and interact with whatever you're doing and to feel like they're part of it. I remember being a kid wanting to always weed eat and, uh, you know, have a lot of fun outside because I thought that would be fun until I realized how much work that actually goes into uh, cutting a, a huge lawn. But this allows my daughter to go out and have a lot of fun with me. I'm going to um, put a video on the end showing it in use. But a couple of things that you should consider with that. While it's very age appropriate at the 2 plus, it's also pretty big for a 2 year old. You know, my daughter, you can see her uh, trying to figure out how she wants to handle it. And it's quite long. You know, it does emulate a weed eater a lot in that way. So just keep that in mind when you're looking at it. Also, uh, use-wise, I think it's very easy to understand how to use, but I had a few questions about it when I first picked it up, so I want to talk about it. You can see the packaging. It's very basic. It has two instructions here. You really don't need a lot of instruction, but things I wanted to know about this, for example, you know, when you're pulling here, I wanted to know exactly how hard this is to pull for a kid. Well, this is very easy, you can tell. When you're pulling it, basically what you're doing is you're making trigger here, and you can see the design inside. Now the design, it's positive and negative in ways. When you're pushing it, you notice it basically taking that, you're cranking it up basically to let it run. The downside to that is that it's eventually gonna die down and they're gonna have to crank it quite a bit. You know, you can see how fast those few cranks died down. Now you can crank it up quite a bit and get it going, but it's gonna take a lot more work. That is the downside to not having a battery, but the upside again is not having a battery. Now when looking at the uh, the make of it, my daughter's been pretty rough on it, banging it around. You can see a few little scratch marks here and there, but by and large, this is pretty tough. They didn't skimp on the, uh, the design. You know, they actually bolted things in when they needed to. They again, when they're constructing, a lot of times with cheap products, you might see, you know, one or two bolts here and there. Well, this, I mean, look at how it's set up. This is actually a John Deere licensed product too. So I imagine they wanted to do pretty well when they were incorporating everything in that. You can look at it, like I say, it's, um, it, it emulates a weed eater so well. It's even got the, uh, the handle here, again, crank. This is a lot like a weed eater that I have. You know, obviously it has more to it, but still for a kid, that really gets the idea out. The set also comes with a spade, and uh, my daughter calls this a grass saw. <laughs> she thinks you saw grass with it, which I think is funny. It's really cool. But, uh... You can look at the designs here. You can see how they're put together. Again, they're bolted on. They're very sturdy. There's not a lot here to damage. Stickers are already on this set too. And you can tell with that, look, I'm trying to rub it off here. It's not working. So that's actually pretty good. It's actually got texture and everything. These are really designed well. I like the, uh, the spade here. You could actually dig with it. A lot of times when you get a toy, you know, it won't work out for anything, but this can actually be used. So, I thought that was kind of impressive. Overall, I really like this set. I think it's around uh, $15 now. So for that price, it's not terrible at all. You know, it comes with a lot. And again, you know, it is the right time for it. And it'll let your kid feel like they're interacting with you. And it can be a great positive experience. You can also use it as a segue to really having them do things like that. <laughs> so anyway, if you like that, you know, uh, leave me a thumbs up. If you have any questions, comment, and I will try to get back to you. Thanks.